Life doesn't always go according to plan, but it's how we handle the curveballs that define us. Learn in this inspiring story of finding purpose and meaning in the face of adversity. In a humble village, there lived a poor old man. In his possession there was a magnificent white horse, a creature that caught the attention of passing noblemen. They would approach the old man, offering him vast sums of money for the stallion, but he would always decline, claiming that the horse was his dear friend. How can I sell my friend, he would say with a warm smile. One fateful morning, the old man awoke to find his beloved horse missing. The village people gathered around him, shaking their heads and sighing, Old man, you were a fool for not selling the horse. Think of the wealth you could have gained. Now it has been stolen, and you are left with nothing. What a great misfortune. Yet, the wise old man did not despair. With a calm demeanor, he replied, Let us not jump to conclusions. Whether the horse was stolen or not, and whether its absence is a misfortune or a blessing, remains unknown. All we know is that the horse is no longer in the stable. Days turned into nights, and just when the village had resigned itself to the loss, one day the white horse returned, accompanied by several beautiful horses. The villagers rejoiced and gathered around the old man, exclaiming, Old man, you were right. The horse was not stolen. It was not a misfortune but a blessing in disguise. Now you have many fine horses and opportunities abound. Once again, the old man displayed his wisdom, cautioning them, do not be hasty in your judgments. Let us refrain from labeling this as either a good or a bad thing. Simply acknowledge that the horse has returned, and whether it is a blessing or misfortune, only time will tell. As fate would have it, tragedy struck when the old man's only son began to train the horses. In a harrowing accident, he was thrown off and trampled, leaving one of his legs badly broken. The villagers rushed to the old man, expressing their condolences, Old man, you were right once again. It was not a blessing but a great misfortune. Your only son is now hurt, and our hearts ache for you both. With a sigh, the old man responded, Let us not be so quick to pass judgment. Rather than labeling this event as good or bad, let us acknowledge that my son has broken his leg. Whether it is a blessing or misfortune is unknown, as the full story has yet to unfold. A few weeks later, the winds of war swept across the land, and all able-bodied young men were forcibly taken for military duty. The village was consumed by grief and anguish, fearing that their sons would never return. In their despair, they turned to the old man, their voices trembling, you were right old man. Your son's injury has proven to be a blessing. Though he may be crippled, he is still with you, while our sons have been taken away forever. The wise old man simply shook his head, with a knowing smile. He gently uttered words that echoed with profound wisdom, it is not about labeling events as good or bad. Let us recognize that your sons have been forced into the military, while my son has not. More than that, the full story remains unknown. In this captivating tale, we witness the power of perspective. Life's events are not always what they seem. What may initially appear as a misfortune could turn out to be a blessing, and vice versa. The old man's ability to embrace uncertainty and withhold judgment serves as a powerful reminder for us all. So, let us embrace the uncertainties of life and approach each event with an open mind, refraining from hasty judgments. Remember, the full story is yet to unfold, and its true meaning may surprise us. If you found this tale inspiring and thought-provoking, like this video and subscribe to our channel. Join our community of like-minded individuals seeking motivation and wisdom. Thank you for watching, I'll see you in the next story.